I look like I play the piano and my name is Beethoven. So today we're gonna be doing something a little bit different and I feel like it's gonna be so fun. This is gonna be called the Sponsor Wig versus the My Coins Wig. A wig company by the name of Gorgeous Wigs or Gorgeous Hair. It's a very popular TikTok wig company. I know you've seen this girl bouncing all up and down your For You page. They actually reached out to me because they saw what's papping on TikTok and they wanted to do a sponsorship or a collab. Little did they know, I already bought that same wig. So what I'm gonna do is make sure that the sponsor wig that they gave me, they also are giving their customers who are paying with their actual coins. Because what we do know is the sponsor Jones always get the good wigs, but not on my watch, not on my watch. So first I wanna do the specs of the wig just so we can know what we're getting ourselves into. And the name of the wig is Natural Afro Curly Fringe Wig with the Bang Yang. So the original price of the wig, it says it's $159, but these wig companies always have some sort of discount going on. So all in all, I actually got a good price on it, which was $131. To me, for a wig, not too bad. One thing that I noticed that there was only one length on the site, which was 14 inches. For me, I like to have a little variety, you know? Material Girl style. When it came to the shipping, the shipping was very fast. I ordered it on January 28th. It shipped out January 29th, and then I got it on February 4th. I know that sounds crazy, but it's actually just a week. So the shipping is great. Now this is the part where I usually do like reviews and comments from their YouTube, their website, or their IG, but this company is either very calculated or they just are not as known, so a lot of people don't comment on them, or it really is that good. So on their website, it was literally nothing but five star reviews, which is always suspicious. It's very suspicious. Because no wig is five stars. No wig. I don't care how much the wig is, it's not five stars. No. Their IG doesn't have any comments at all, so I don't know if they're completely scrubbing it or just people just aren't actively making comments on their IG and they are probably aren't paying reviewers to actually put a review on their IG like other companies do because they do do that. And then their YouTube, they have no YouTube presence at all. TikTok is probably where they get the most traction at and where you'll see the most like people like interacting with the actual content in the actual wig. Um, but even there, when you have the sponsor girls that are doing their things, everyone in the comments are saying how great the wig looks, everything, but there was no updates. And there's also no one saying like, hey, I got this wig, it was trash. Hey, I got this wig, it was beautiful. No one, not yet. And then for the girls who weren't sponsored, they also did reviews on the wig and all of them were positive as well. I will say, I think that this company does give you what it says that it gives you. Like what you see is what you get. Now let's get to the fun part. I bought one with my own coins and then there's a sponsor one. So these are it. Can't read it backwards, but it says my coins and the other one says sponsored. Um, so that's how we'll be doing these up. So I'm gonna try both of them on, compare and contrast. And let's go. We're gonna start with, this. I don't do unboxing, so it's not gonna be that. So we're gonna start off with the sponsor wig first and see what it looks like straight out the box. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I look like I play the piano and my name is Beethoven. Um, yeah, this is the sponsor, John. Let's try it. This is my coins, and I just look like Beethoven's brother. So in this part, I'm actually gonna go through the process of what I did with both of the wigs. Um, so you'll get to see it, and you can hear me talk about it a little bit. The sponsored wig is on the left, and the one that I did with my coins is on the right. So the most important thing about this wig is picking it out and putting some type of water or moisture on it. That's so important with this wig because you are not going to get the result you want if you don't do that. Now the most difficult part about this wig is that bayang. That bayang is going to throw you for a loop. So your best option is to wet it, soak that joint up, and then pick it. Once I did that, it became a lot easier. It wasn't like straight across or anything like that. It, it actually sat very well, but you have to work with that bayang. 
so the key to this wig is you have to keep playing with it you have to keep putting water in it you have to keep picking it you have to keep stretching it out to your liking until it looks the way you want it to look Now this is the results for both of them. The one on the left is the sponsored and the one that I bought is on the right. And to me, they look very similar. I don't see any real differences. I really like this wig. They're both soft. They both have that same curl pattern when I got it. So I think they did well. Well, gorgeous, you check out. Since the wig that I played with my own coins matched exactly the wig that they gave me for collaboration slash sponsor. So they check out as a company. So if you like this wig, I'll have all the details of it in the description box. And please like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend and tell a friend and tell a friend about me. And see you on the next investigation. Bye.